myself. This is finer compared to the brown. This is the brown dressing forceps because it is only what contains serration. You can grasp this one. Don't use this to grasp the edges of the tissue because undue pressure will cause necrosis. Unlike when you are going to use this one, you just apply this at the edge of the incision. This one, dito, di ba? Yan po yung sabi niyo pong tissue. Oh, process. tissue, because it will just penetrate a point uh, area in this one. So, it will strongly and prevent the pits of the tissues. Compared to this one, it will easily slide, di ba? So that the tendency would be to apply more pressure the more pressure you are going to apply, the more injury you are going to cause at the edge. As actually, yung entire edge dito, then just a part dito, di ba? Okay, <laughs> Ito lang. lang. Kasi kung tissue forceps, just the tip. Not this one. Not apply this one. Dito so, lang. So, hindi na lang po ito? Eh, mas uh, fine naman yung... That's ano. why, that's why, for, uh, for uh, ano, minor surgery, it is used this one. But this is not readily available. All what is what would be available would be the, the larger one. Kasi ito parang special type. Then this one is cocker because it is similar to this grasping forceps. It contains the teeth that can interdigitate between the two and you have one. So when you are going to clump again and apply traction, this is quite strong. Then compared to the Kelly. This is Kelly the same. You have to you have to grasp it a lot of tissues. Unlike this one, you can also remove particles of bone using this one because this is very strong. At saka, pag stone, it will grasp uh, <laughs> uh, effectively. So ito, ito yung ano, when you are going to close, when you are going to grasp, Iko close mo palagi. When you are going to open, iganon mo lang. Use this one. Just depress. Mm -hmm. Kasi yung iba ginaganon. I, I depress mo lang. Mm -hmm. huh? yeah. This is uh, this is tawe. I Alice know that you have platen triangular with the very fine teeth dito. So when you are going to apply, it can hold the tissues and you can grasp. Then another one would be bobcock. You have uh, cylindrical uh, uh, configuration and tubular when you are going to close. So that when you are going to, for instance, this is the tubular bowel, you can just close. Hindi naman masakit. Kasi very fine tip, it will just bend. This one is... Uh, Mosquito forceps grasping, for instance, you are going to have this one supposedly parang blood vessel. So when <laughs> the tip, if it after cutting, you can just cross this one. Ito. Oh, la ligate, la ligate. So when you are going to ligate, for instance, here, ganon mo lang kagat. Like for instance, you are going to hold this one. Then ligate after making first row, then tighten, release. Kasi na ano na yung blood vessel eh. eh release mo na. Open. You open, you open. Ah, open ka release ka. meaning to say open. Yeah. Sige, you pull. Yeah. Okay, so that is the mosquito. Amazing. Then after, yes, this is the mayo. It is severe construct compared to dissecting scissors. There are about dissecting but this is used mo for more tougher tissues like fascia or a uh, big amount of muscular tissue. This one is for dissecting meaning to say when you are going to dissect you cut a small piece of uh, tissues then afterwards you spread. So when you are dissecting for instance a mass Underneath, you can this one spread, and so on. in that way, that is uh, what you call dissecting. So, cut and spread. And, yeah.
So, but pa yung iba blunt lang, hindi na nila... Hindi, if, if, if you can develop plain, because usually tissues have planes, a vascular yung plane. So, you just push. So, what is holding, you can cut. Ipupus mo lang. Sometimes you can use your finger, actually, pa ganun. So, if your finger is being impeded by the connective tissue, that's it, then you're going to cut. Then afterwards, i-ganun naman. Pero, parang 